I'm Sarah. Welcome to The Daily English Show. Today's guest is Misato. She spent a year in Toronto in Canada and she's now a student at Hokusei Gakuen University in Sapporo, Japan. I met her at this year's JOLT conference in Sapporo and I asked her why she came to the conference. I joined a volunteer in Toyako Summit, a G8 Summit mm. volunteer, so and it was fun, so I joined this too. Kia ora, in stick news today, a girl's eardrum was ruptured due to an excessively passionate kiss. Reuters has reported a girl in her 20s went to a hospital in southern China completely deaf in her left ear. Doctors said the damage was caused by a passionate kiss with her boyfriend. A doctor said the kiss reduced pressure in the mouth, pulled the eardrum out and caused the breakdown of the ear. They said the woman's hearing would likely return to normal after about two months. A report in a Chinese newspaper said while kissing is normally very safe, doctors advise people to proceed with caution. And that was Stick News for Monday the 8th of December. Kia ora. Why are you studying English? What were you doing in Canada? What was your job? Was that a good experience? Do you have any advice for people who are learning English? What movies do you recommend? How do you study with movies? I like English and I enjoyed many English movies and music. And the first time I studied English at junior high school, my teacher was really nice. She taught us Beatles songs and so that's why mm. I got interested in English. I was studying at ESL for about four months and I had a work permit so I was working there. I was working at a vintage store in kind of Kensington Market. My co-worker was very nice and there are many foreigners and immigrants in China so they are very friendly even though my English wasn't perfect. They tried to understand my thoughts and feelings. I they just enjoy because I studied English mostly from movies and music and magazines. My favorite mu movie is Eternal Sunshine. First, I watched with Japanese subtitles and later I watched with uh, English subtitles. And if I find some interesting phrase or idioms, I try to take notes. Misato became interested in English thanks to her teacher introducing her to songs by A. The Beatles, B. The Beach Boys, C. The Rolling Stones. A. Whereabouts in Canada did Misato stay? A. Halifax, B. Toronto, C. Vancouver. B. What was she doing in Canada? A. Just studying. B. Just working. C. Studying and working. C. What kind of shop was she working in? A. A village store. B. A vinegar store. C. A vintage store. C. How did Misato say she studied English? A mostly from movies, music, and magazines, B, mostly from textbooks, C, mostly from the Daily English Show. A. And that was the Daily English Show. See you tomorrow. Bye.